hey guys welcome back to another video i hope everyone is doing fabulous today so guys today i have a victoria's secret haul i ordered some items in their semi-annual sale and i got them good while but I kind of just check them off to make sure I got everything and kind of put the box to the side because I knew I wanted to do a haul for you guys. So, I, you know, I was kind of saving, smelling everything and trying out everything until we do it together. So that's what we're doing here today, guys. And let me tell you, Victoria's Secret really tried it with the packaging, guys. <laughs> this is what Victoria's Secret sent to my house. This big old box. Guys, give my husband a heart attack when he saw this big box show up at the house. Like he thought it was full of stuff, but no, it was just a few things. Nothing crazy, guys. Cause as usual, I shot the sale like really, really late. So I got the tail end of the bargains, which not really bargains. I've known Victoria's Secret to have sale. You know, even back in Jamaica when I was looking online when they had their semi-annual sales, the prices usually are a bit, you know cheaper than what they are but the good thing is because i waited you know like almost when the sale was over i did get the semi-annual sale plus an extra 10 percent off so you understand happy about that so guys remember do did do like up the video them share up the video them guys don't forget to hit that subscribe button hit the bell select all notifications so the moment there's a new video you're the first to know so because i shopped online these are my invoices guys and most of the body mist i got for like four fifty four dollar fifty four dollar forty eight cents so good i think that that's pretty good because usually you you will get even if you get a sale like buy one get one or buy two get one it's usually when you do the maths it's more pricey so i think i did get a good little bargain so in the package they also sent over some testers in the form of for these little strips so one at the front and then one at the back you just peel you can smell it to see if you actually like the fragrance so i will test these out later I always get the question if i am a bath and body works girl or i'm a victoria's secret girl and honestly i would say i'm more of a victoria's secrets girl so i just i prefer the lotion i prefer the body mist and their perfumes usually smell like a luxury perfume so i find that i do like bath and body works too i just a little i'm a little bit more on the victoria's secret side so i did shop uh, two of their perfumes usually in their semi-annual sale they would bring back a lot of their retired scents so you can stock up on them and the first one i got is their victoria's secret bombshell paris it's still sealed so i'm going to do a little bit of unboxing here and i bought two by mystic so probably gift somebody one one lucky person will get one of these so we can smell it together it's all the perfume french cypress night blooming jasmine white cedar wood and this fragrance if i remember correctly i would say it's more if you're a woman that you like, you would say, you know, men's cologne smell better than women's perfume, then this may be a fragrance for you. So this is what the bottle is looking like. Very cute, very feminine for your little display. Love it. I mean, for some, if you're a florally girl and you're not really into stronger smelling perfume then probably it's not for you but i love it it smells really really good as i say if you are the type of person that thinks if you are the type of girl that thinks men's cologne smell better or you will use your husband's or your boyfriend's cologne this is for you and for the bombshell paris perfume i paired it with the lotion as well oh so the perfume i got for 14.98 and the lotion i got for 7.50 so not bad the other perfume i got guys is rapture and this one i was very excited to try they say it's a cologne actually beyond love there is rapture bulgarian rose amber musk so 
I assume this is a more of a musky. If you're into musky scents, probably a stronger scent as well, not too florally, then this may be a good one for you. Let's just do the <laughs> let's just do the unboxing. So this is it is kind of smaller than I thought it would be and <laughs> this almost it literally almost knocked me out it's very it's very strong it kind of why it remind me of elizabeth taylor white diamonds it remind me of elizabeth taylor white diamonds like i can imagine it would last all day and i would describe it as A more mature woman would wear this. I, I like mature scents, so it no bother me, but it's a very it's not florally at all, and they are right, it is more of a cologne. Very, very strong. And this was like $19 on the sale. I also got the lotion as well. So this is the lotion, and I'm just going to try to see if it is just as strong as the as they say cologne i think it's good because if this was strong to it would have been like a knockout pouch would i just knock out everybody that you come in contact with so i'm happy that it's not as overpowering at all that's good the lotion for rapture was um i think about 750 as well in the bombshell collection i also got bombshell in bloom i really wanted to get the perfume but it was sold out by the time i went online so listen guys i don't know how it's going to go with me smelling so much oh now if you're a girly girl this is a girly girl body mist next up guys i have the neon lily lotion and i think i got the body mist as well oh yeah so i got the set so let's talk about the lotion it is neon lily it's a very florally uh say vibrant lily day glow i like this lotion a lot very girly and just vibrant very sweet very very sweet and then the body mist now a lot of the fragrances that they sell during their sale are retired fragrances so just bear that in mind the fragrance mist is barely there barely there barely 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 there next up i have before the rain fragrance mist i got this one just because of the name before the rain it just sounds very fresh and just you know so i got it and so at first you don't really smell it but then there's something that just hits you after a while which I like. It says rain kissed the lilies, bright yuzu or yuzu clean air stills as clouds gather. Love it. It really embody what they were trying to achieve with the you know the before the rain vibe and even the how it looks on the bottle. Opposite of rain is what? Sun. So I got the set in the early morning sun. I got the fragrance mist and the lotion. Uh, let's smell the fragrance mist first. Let it marinate a little. As opposed to the before the rain, this is more, it's giving me a more like a warmer smell. So it's not very bright and it doesn't hit you or anything. Very more warm and like a, you know, something you would spray on like when you're around the house and all of that so it's early morning sun and it says orange blossom white santal 
was worn by the glow of light so yes and then i assume you know pairing it with the lotion will kind of bring it up a little bit more in that same collection i got the beneath the palm so so the lotion and the fragrance mist i'm trying to spray inside the covers just because it's best that way very fresh i would say a very fresh fragrance See, it says aloe water lush greens float on the breeze yeah very fresh this is a very fresh if you're the type of person you don't really like the floral layer the sweetie sweetie fragrances this would be this is nice so i like it because not every occasion or every day you want to just smell sweet, right? Sometimes you just want to be chill, have a nice little fragrance on you, but nothing too loud or in your face. So, And then if you pair it with a lotion, of course, that kind of, you know, bring it out a little bit more. So, yeah, it's good. It's fresh and nice. I also picked up this one. It's called Bright Palm, and I got it because it says coconut milk find your shine it's so exciting so i was very excited to get this one so this one smells really really good it's the coconut in it is not as overpowering as the coconut passion and when i say overpowering it's not overpowering where i do not like my coconut passion i love it but it's this one is more it's more subtle but it smells really really good next up guys this one is a girly scent is horizon in bloom so it's a very this is a floral scent uh wildflowers shimmer in the distance so i i know how this one smells already very florally and vibrant yeah very very vibrant so another nice scent i so far i am in love with all my selections and the next one i got here is the electric poppy or poppy smells very citrusy to me yes yeah, sparkling pear bright no very citrusy i would say it smells good as well and then kind of finally guys i got this sancho pay beach orchid Ooh. it have a zing let's see it says coral honeysuckle sancho peso leo this one whoo it comes out so lush it's giving very citrusy very vibrant and nice yeah love it love it it's so good i love it i'm not gonna want to make a put on well you put it over my clothes but why it smell like ice cream <laughs> it smell i don't know it smell like you ever had coconut ice cream from devonos kind of smell like that so guys that's it for this victoria's secrets haul i hope you guys enjoyed the video i'm very excited to add all these fragrances to my collection i love the variety in the the fragrances that i got some are knockout punch like the rapture i have some citrusy ones florally ones fresh ones so very very excited guys remember do did do like up the video them share up the video them guys and if you're not already subscribed please go ahead hit that subscribe button hit the bell so like all notifications so you're notified every time there is a new video love you guys and i'll see you in the next one bye guys